Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Today, we've got episode number 86 of the San Diego Padres franchise mode here on the channel, and it is game number two of the National League Championship Series. We did win game one in the last episode. We blew out the Milwaukee Brewers here at home at Petco Park, and we are looking to do the same here in game two. Pitching for your Padres will be the left-hand pitcher, Joey Lucchese, and for the Milwaukee Brewers will be Freddie Peralta. And in the last episode, the Brewers played Tyrone Taylor, an outfielder, at first base. This game, they have a guy who actually has first base as a secondary position. That is Ronnie Rodriguez. So there won't be a million errors at first. I mean, there wasn't too many in the last game, honestly, with Tyron Taylor. I expected more just because of what we had in opening day when Cole Calhoun played first base for the Diamondbacks. But we still won that game 9-2. to And Chris Paddock, man, balled out. Zach Brown, the pitcher for the Brewers, really didn't play too well. So we did get through that game one pretty easily and folks real quick before we start this episode hit that subscribe button down below this is day number 86 straight of Padres uploads and just that like button down below as well if you like the content let's get straight into it Padres Brewers game two we're looking to take this two nothing lead before we head over to Miller Park in Milwaukee for games three through five here comes Joy Lucchese one start so far in the postseason lost that game game three of the NLDS area of 13.5 over four innings, looking to turn things around here tonight. Obviously, Al Garcia going to leave things off on the 1-1, one -one, get that ball right to Rwanda. Franco, Franco, one down the inning. Here's the Spurs lineup. Of course, not a great lineup. I mean, we got Yelich in here on Escobar, probably the best bats on this team, along with Avisal Garcia. Now on the two to the left fielder, Ben Gamble going to hit that ball right back to the mound. There is Joe Lucchese, two down in the inning. Here comes Christian Yelich, the MVP for the Brewers, getting that ball right up the middle. There is, for now, Tajis Jr., three up to down. Let's go to the bottom of the first pitching for the Brewers. Will be Freddie Peralta, one start to front of the postseason, ERA of 5.79, over four and two-thirds innings. He will see Brian Reynolds on the 3-2, getting that ball deep into right field. Christian Yelich, though, going to get it for the first out of the ball game, allowed out. Here's your Padres lineup. we got Reynolds, Tatis, Bryant, Vogi, Garver, Robles, Juan Franco, C. James, and Joey Lucchese. For now, Tatis Jr. on the 1-1, one -one, get that breaking over the middle of the plate curveball right to third thank you let's go let's go Eduardo Escobar gonna make the error to start this ball game off Chris Bryant gonna pop that ball up right to first though right to Ronnie Rodriguez an actual player who actually plays in the infield and by the way in the AL the Houston Astros have taken a one nothing lead over the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim on the 3-1 that's gonna be a walk fastball and misses for Daniel Vogelbach runners up first and second here on the 3-2 full count we'll take it base is loaded now Four. Victor Robles on the three on Robles gonna hit that high fastball line drive loud out right to left field on the good good the Brewers are gonna get out of it still a tie ball game swing and a miss Keston here on that high curve now up will be Eduardo Escobar that pitch is gonna run in and hit him that's a base runner for the Brewers Omar Navarro is gonna hit that ball into deep left field but there is CJ Abrams under Abrams is there for the second out of the inning now up will be Luis Urias on the one two and that ball right to second easy play for Wander Franco let's go now to the bottom of the second still 0-0 zero, zero. of the plate will be the switch hitting Wander Franco gonna hit that ball right to second Keston here though what a play the spin he's got him first out of the inning 3-2 to CJ Abrams gonna blast that ball right to second good good one-on-one -on -one off the bat but an out right to Keston here and Joe Lucchese what do you expect there's an out on to the top of the third. Ronnie Rodriguez gonna hit that ball. Right pass short. Right pass for now. Tatis Jr. A lead off single for the Milwaukee Brewers. Easy bunt situation here for Freddie Peralta. He's gonna hit that ball right to Vogie. Vogie's gonna make the play, but it does move Rodriguez over to second. Now, obviously, Al Garcia on the 3 2. Gonna draw the walk on the change up down. Runners up for the second here. Still one out for Ben Gamble. Gonna hit that ball right to second. Wander Franco gonna try to go second. Franco. Okay, we got the out. Runners in the corners here. Two outs for Christian Yelch on the 1-1. One -one. Yelch gets that ball right to Franco. Thank goodness. Go back to second. Got him to end the inning. Still scoreless are the Brewers. Brian Reynolds in the 2-2. Two -two. Gonna blast that ball deep into right field. Yelich can't catch this one. There we go. Brian Reynolds should have two easy. Maybe three. No, he's gonna stay at two for a leadoff double. For now, Tatis Jr. on the 1-1. One -one. Gonna blast that ball right up the middle. There is Fernando Tatis Jr. We're sending Brian Reynolds to the plate. Oh, they hit the cut. We'll take it. one nothing lead. For the Padres, Chris Bryant on the one. I'm gonna fly that ball deep, deep into center field. But there is Avi Sal Garcia, one down in the inning. Now, now bring up the power hitting team of Vogelbach in the two one. Vogi just gonna pop that ball up right to first, right to Ronnie Rodriguez, two down in the inning. Mitch Garver now will come up on the full count. Garver gonna hit that high curveball right into the ground though, right to short. There we go. 
The Brewers do get out of it, but 1-0 lead for the Padres. And that's a broken bat right there by Keston here. Lucchese got to hurry up. Joe Lucchese. There we go. The pitch is going to get there for the first out. Now, Eduardo Escobar going to hit that part right to second. Wander Franco going to make the play, though, to down in the inning. The Brewers can't get anything going so far. And that ball is going to be hit right to right field. Right to Brian Reynolds. That's going to end the inning. Four scoreless for Joe Lucchese. Victor Robles on the 1-2 going to hit that ball. Right into center field. Will it get down? Obviously, Garcia is there, though, in shallow center for the first out of the inning. Franco now in the 3-1. Going to draw the walk on the fastball away. We will take it. Runner on first. One out for the second baseman. Turn left fielder. CJ Abrams swing and miss, though, on that pitch down. Joe Lucchese on the 2-1. Get that ball right to first. Damn it, Rodriguez going to knock that ball down. I mean, he's a shortstop. He should make the play. He's got it. On the top of the fifth, swing and a miss on that pitch down. There we go. The first out of the inning is Luis Arias. Now, Ronnie Rodriguez in the 3-2, swing and a miss on the pitch down by Joe Lucchese. The change at Freddy Peralta on the 1-2 Peralta. Damn, he's going to get a hit into left field. Freddy Peralta is really bad. Extend this inning with a two-out double. Like, dude, what is going on? All right. Now, it will be the leadoff hitter, Avisal Garcia. And Avisal Garcia going to hit that ball in center field. Victor Robles, you need to hurry the hell up. Robles to the plate. Oh, it hits offline. So, Freddy Peralta extended this inning. And now, it's a tie ball game. I don't know what to say. Ben Gamble going to hit that ball, though, in left field. Abrams, oh my goodness. I thought he dropped that. Thank goodness he got to that one. 1-1, one, one. Reynolds. Uh, good, good. Right to short. That's a line out. For now, Tidy Stewart, swing to miss on the change of away. Two down in the inning. For Chris Bryant now on the 2 one Bryant going to hit that ball deep in the center field on the good, good. There we go. Going to go all the way back to the fence. That's a two-out double for Chris Bryant. Can that give us a run like it did the Brewers? I don't know. Vogie in the 1-1. One, one. Vogie get that ball deep into left field. Ben Gamble giving chase. Gamble, he's got it to end the bottom of the fifth inning. Still tied at 1. Christian Yelich now up in the 3 one Get that ball right in between for now. Tachi Sr. and Chris Bryant. It's a leadoff single for Yelich. Now the plate will be Keston here on the one here. Gonna go opposite field into right. It's gonna get down back to back base knocks just like that for Milwaukee. Now Escobar to first. Vogie to Tatis to short. Tatis back to Vogie. Got him. Double play. There we go. Just like that. Two down in the inning. Omar Navarez to second. Wander Franco. Gotta hurry up. Franco. We're gonna be out of the inning. Still tied. Now here comes Mitchell Jordan to pitch. ERA of 1.5 in the postseason. Over four games and six innings. He will see Mitch Garver on the 1-1. One -one. Garver going to hit that ball right up the middle, but right to Keston here in the shift. One down in the inning. Victor Robles now on the 2-2. Two -two. Robles going to hit that ball over the middle. It's a base knock on the good good for Victor Robles. We got a base runner here with one out. Now Wander Franco on the 2-2. Two -two. Franco going to hit that ball right to second. There we go. Here I can't get to it. Runners off first and second here. One out for CJ Abrams on the 1-1. One -one. Abrams get that ball over the middle. He picked that. Oh my god. He really got to that one. All right, we're safe in the corners. Here comes O'Neal Cruz. One for three so far in the postseason. Can he deliver once more on the 2-2 Cruz? No. Right to here at second. The Brewers are going to get out this inning. Still tied at one. Here comes two men. Three games so far in the postseason. Two and two-thirds innings. ERA of 3.38 for the former Oriole. On the 1-1. One, one. Urias, no! Luis Urias gonna go yard. Chumin's first batter of the ball game, and he's gonna pay for it. He left one right over the middle of the plate, and the Brewers have taken a 2-1 lead here in the top of the seventh, just like that. Up now at the plate will be the first baseman, Ronnie Rodriguez on the 1-2. Rodriguez get that ball right into right field. It's back-to-back -back base knocks. For the Milwaukee Brewers, pinch hitting now will be Corey Ray. Did get the start in game one of the series. Will come off the bench now on the 2-1. Reagan at that ball into center field. Robles is there, though, to make the play for the first out of the top of the seventh. Now up at the plate will be Avisal Garcia on the 1-1. Garcia going to hit that one right in the ground. Tatis to Wander Frank. Going to turn it. Ah, uh, yep. Garcia going to get in there. Now on the 1-2. Gamble going to find that ball deep into center field. Oh, goodness. It's getting the gap. Robles, though. What a play, Victor Robles. Going to control the damage. Here comes JP Fearon signed to pitch. ERA of zero over four innings in four games so far in the postseason. Brian Reynolds on the 2-1. on Reynolds. Damn, just going to pop that ball up into left field. Ben Gamble is under it for the first out of the inning. Now up will be for now Tatis Jr. on the 1-1. One -one. Tatis going to bounce that ball right to third. Easy play for Eduardo Escobar. Two down in the inning. Chris Bryant now on the 1-1. One -one. Bryant going to pop that ball up right in the infield. Who's going to take it? Who wants it? Ronnie Rodriguez at first going to take it to end the inning. Here comes Jose Castillo. One game so far in the postseason. Only pitched 
two outs, ERA of nothing. He will see. Christian Yelich on the one, two. Yelich get that ball right to the shortstop for now. Taji Jr. in the shift, one down in the inning. Now up, we'll be catching here on the three, two. There we go. Cold strike three on the slider way. We'll take it. Jose Castillo. Eduardo Escobar gonna hit that ball right up the middle. Can Wander Franco hurry up and make the play though? Franco can't get it. Brewers gonna get a base runner on with two outs. Now that ball's gonna be right on the three, two. It's gonna be back to back. Base knocks. For the Brewers now with that Omar Novara's hit. Here comes Andres Munoz. Two games so far in the postseason. Here we have nothing over two and one third innings with three strikeouts. On the 2-2 to Urias. Urias get that ball over the middle. Victor Robles got to watch the plate. They're going to hold him. Base is loaded now for Ronnie Rodriguez. Another 3 two. Munoz, that's clutch. The 102 mile an hour fastball up gets him for strike three. Jake Faria now going to come out to pitch the eighth inning. No runs given up so far in the postseason. Vogie on the 1 2. Daniel Vogelbach going to get a hold of that one in a deep right center field. But there's Avisal Garcia, one down the inning. Mitch Garver now on the 2 1. Garver going to lift that ball deep into center field. That's going back to the track. Avisal Garcia, he's there though. Two down the inning. Now Victor Robles on the one, two. Robles get that ball again to center field, but Avisal Garcia is everywhere. All right, one, two, three inning. Let's go to the top of the ninth. Munoz still pitching on the three, two. There we go. Strike three on the slider in. Avisal Garcia now on the one, one get that ball into right field, but right to Brian Reynolds. Two down the inning just like that. Ben Gale now on the two, two. Swain miss on the slider running in. All right, uh, we got to see Josh Hader. Mans did not blow a single save this season incredible stuff dude's making himself out to be like the best relief pitcher of all time that's gonna be strike three it's just so hard to hit off this guy i'm gonna bring julio rodriguez in for abrams abrams would just have hell against josh Hader. so on the two on rodriguez get that ball left field there we go we got a base runner on winning run now to the plate and it will be carmen ruiz has been so good this season in getting pinch hit homers and just hits on the one one ruiz no Going to fly that ball into center field. There is Avisal Garcia. Two down in the inning. Brian Reynolds now on the 1-1. Our last hope. Reynolds into left field. It's going to get down. It's going to bleed. First and second. Runners on. Fernando Tatis here on the 1-2. Tatis, no! That slider, man, so tough. It's so tough. I mean, I'm telling you. If you get into, like, the ninth inning with Josh Hader, it is honestly so tough. I mean, even in real life. I mean, I know he didn't do too well in the wild card game, but still... Josh Hader, man, is an absolute beast. We've got to stay out of that ninth inning with him because if we do, I mean, it's kind of a it's kind of a game over just like that because Hader, that slider and the fastball, I know it's only two pitches really, but I mean, his two seems kind of like a change up anyway because it's just such a different um, velocity change than the four seam. It's tough. So we head to Milwaukee now, all tied up. It's one to one now in the series. And we head into game three, and Christopher Bond will take the mount in Milwaukee. Folks, stick around for that one tomorrow. Episode number 87 will be heading your way, of course, game three of the NLCS. Again, thank y'all for watching. The subscribe button down below if you haven't yet, and hit that like button. Again, thank y'all for watching, and Mamba forever.